What's good, Homo Squad? It's your boy, Homo Ziggy. We back here with music, mayhem for y'all. And hey, we got eight. I put up the number nine. <laughs> we got eight songs for y'all today and such. And look, where my headphones at? We just gonna go straight right into it, man. We on the road to 2K, like you already know. In no secret, because we on the road to 2K, like I say, so. You better check this first song out, which is my guy Aizen with Shining. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get in the video. To the mountains, I know what's best for me. Let's nice pick up Chuck walking in abundance. I'm shining, sun is shining. Got a mountain in front of me, it's worth the climbing. Chapter that we got a lot, got a view from the top. Watch the blessings come to me. I don't really got a lot, I grind, I stop. Watch the money come in OD. Trees on trees, heady the commies, and I got the keys. Hey, the chamber it come out of nice little throwback to his first song, Henry to commies. And I see in the comments where it's saying about the part one was heading to commies, heading up to commies, and then now uh, part two with this one being shining, basically saying about how you're at the top now, but you always have to like. Let me actually go to a comment where it says right here saying about the shining. When you make it to commies and you're reflecting on your journey and still wanting to reach higher in a way so far within these 52 seconds it seems like it i got the keys i hit the chamber and come out of bees ultra instinct i move through you with ease mm. like time just scales ahead of my time like hey got me on the mind i'm feeling divine number one on every list i feel the jealousy Instant transmission, okay. Even when he's melody, even when he's trying to be melodic, he still comes with bars. Like, come on. Spirit bomb. Headed to the mountains. I know what's best for me. I'm walking in abundance. I'm shining. Sun is shining. Got a mountain in front of me. It's worth the climbing. Unlocked my potential. It's all mental. When I power up, they trample. I'm influenced. Don't fall, my nigga. <laughs> Treat my body like a temple. I've been up. I said, I want to know when you was making this video, didn't you have the little bit of like height, fear of heights and such? Because, nigga. Ain't no goddamn way I'm doing a video up that high. I'm sorry. It's not going to happen. No way, no how. I don't care how much mo There are certain limits. It's basically this. I'm not saying... In a way, I'm not saying I'm afraid of heights. But it depends on what the height is and such. If it's like 10, 15 feet. Well, actually 10 feet. Then I'm okay with that type of feet. But if it's more than that, then I'm sorry. You is not, I don't care if it's for my music. I am not, well, nah, fuck it. I am not going up that high, especially when it's up mountains. Nah. So you need to tell me you didn't have the little bit. Like, look at this. Nigga, you need to tell me. That you're willing to do your music video knowing that you're up that high in the mountains? Hell nah. I'm so sorry. Couldn't be me. You would have to pay me a big old bunch of money. Treat my body like a temple. I've been up on my fitness. God is my witness. I'ma succeed with the quickness. Hmm. And it's all in the blood. DNA from up above. And it's filled with love. Sometimes my like, ego... Look at that. Like, look at this height, nigga. You need to tell me. You wasn't scared when he was doing. You need to tell me in the middle while doing that video, shooting this video. You see how high you are up there. 
You never one time say, oh, nah, fuck, no, nah, if this. You need to tell me you wasn't scared. Hm. I went, because I know you're going to see this video. I know for a fact you're going to see this video. And you need to tell me, sir. Now that, hold on, let me turn on the But you need to tell me, sir, that while in the makes of making this video, looking at how you see that hat right now, you wasn't scared. Because if you tell me you wasn't, you capping. You lying to yourself. And to me. And it does. I'm a saying with pride, they gon' hit the bloodline just like Frida. But I ain't even trippin'. From the bottom to the top, my mission. I don't need anyone's permission to see dreams come to fruition. Phone on D and D um headed to the mountain. But I like the vision. I know what's best for me. But besides from this whole entire vision, this like look, hide and search, nah. Besides from that. I like the message in the music where even though like I like how it said there that even though he's on the top, right? He still wants to go higher and such. He still wants to succeed. Even though he's already a level of being one of the best, being like becoming the best and such, he wants to go keep on higher and higher. He wants his vision to go even more brighter. So hey, shout out to you, Eisen, for that we message. Walking in abundance. I'm shining. Sun is shining. Got a mountain in front of me. It's worth the climbing. I'm vibrating harder than I ever have. See it a better man. Be it a better man. Yeah. I'm shining. 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 Ooh, the singing. Hey, shout out to you, Aizen, but all I'm saying is, nigga, look, my G, I know you, like I said, I know you're going to see this video, so I need, you need to let me know, you, you were not at one point when you was doing that video shot right there, like, hold on, like, right here, you, I know your ass is looking down, you need to tell me at one point, you wasn't a little bit scared, a little bit, like, timid, Timid and such. Like, nigga, I know I would. But hey, either way, regardless of me, of this whole thing, shout out to you for the message in the music where you want to keep on going higher and higher in your music and in your career and just in life in general. Of trying to better yourself, trying to go, believe, go more, go bigger and better on your path and such. So hey, shout out to you. But now we're on to the next song. Hold on. After this ad. Do you remember the fall? The gloom descended on Skylight. You rallied to protect the beacon. And Got Otaku Underworld. Delta D's irresponsible. With Bungo Stray Dogs AMV. Shawty said she wanna make some arrangements. Get a wedding and I kill it now. Just remember who I was before I go and get famous, baby Cause love won't stop this hell This one I know so well I'm laying with my demons in bed But I don't kiss him down I never do that, no I'm taking the devil by the way I think that I finally see my face I looked death in the face And I told him, tell me straight Hold up, I like that little double time right there With the rapping and such Went into melody Melody, then the rapping, hold up. Taking the devil by the way, so I think that I no, back. Well, I'm with my Start with the singing and then the rapping. Wait, wait. I'm taking the devil by the way, so I think that I finally see my face. So I look death in the face and I told him, tell me straight. How long do I got away? Yeah, yeah. You can't even look me in my face now, shorty. I don't put a lot of point play. Made you feel like you had to escape. I like this beat. Headed out your way, cause I ain't get any response from you. And I can't just let this say. Every time we make content, what it breeds. A contract. 
shack where both of us unappeased mm. Just more conversations repressed because we never speak Commonality with you and my actions that is beneath me Hit it off, wipe you down, know everything's gone streaky Never needed Halloween for us to make it all freaky Summertime on off season, then you miss the ball demon So you make the call even though you know what's going on, Ain't shit changed with the day and the time Made you wait way too long for my pride If I'm being honest, I couldn't make my mind up You gonna throw that back with the emotional in the wind up? Damn. <laughs> Too much motion in the ocean for you, Delta. Hold on, y'all. I just saw y'all not seeing this, and y'all probably not hearing it, but there's like rain outside now. And there was like a little lightning flash, or sometimes. If you see me looking up most of the times, it's mostly that because I'm looking out my window right now and I'm seeing like a bunch of rain. So hopefully it don't make like go away. What you signed up for me in double digit states away and living like a heart. Hopefully I've seen it too. You can't even let me in my face. I don't put a lot of point in play. Made you feel like you had to escape now. Shiny. I know that a lot of you, a lot of you. If they just knows how to make songs, I just just vibe out to No the cap. Delta just knows how to make songs that makes you just want to vibe out. I'm not going to lie to y'all. So shout out to Delta and shout out to Otaku on the world, like I said. But now we on to the next song, which is Digs the Prophecy, Peso P, 954 Mari. I told y'all that I was going to react to this and such. His Gear 5 Luffy rap. This is my peak. So hold on. Let's get that reservation good and let's get it. I told y'all before. Peso has been almost on every freaking Gear 5 song. Like I said, he's been on Game Boy Jones, he's been on Rustages, and now he got his. And now he's on, he got his, and now he's on Diggs. Like, I told you when soon as when that Gear 5 Luffy came out, Peso was going to be on almost every one of them. This is my peg. I was never known to be big. Number one hit. Shout out to the fleet. Only one winner got control of the pig. My pig. I was never known to be big. Number one hit and I roll with the fleet. Coming for the throne with a sig. Only one winner got control of the pig. Yeah, in control. I send a hit day on patrol. I never been bitch. I never been troll. We beat them quick and get them gone. Bitch, how the tips they do shit inside that clip. You better have some sea stone. I told him my brother I can't. Bro, peso is like style of rapping. It just, just the minute you hear it, makes you just want to, you saw how quick as soon as when I hear him come in, I just want to dance and such. Because he just got that style where, it's basically like this, as a rapper or as an artist and such, whenever you have like a specific sound and such, and people just automatically get lit to, automatically start vibing out to it and then start getting lit and crazy with it, you know you automatically... You know you automatically have a fan that likes it. Well, basically what I'm trying to say is like, once that style hits and such, you're going to connect with it instantly. Coming with the, the artist. With Only one Just within the instant he came in, like... Yeah, in control. I send a hit, they on patrol. I never been bitch, I never been troll. We beat them quick and get them gone. Uh, bitch, how the tips ain't do shit inside that clip. You better have some sea stone. I told her no brother, I can't do undercover with our rubber. Just leave me alone. Mm. Think solar eclipse. I'm gonna go giant, that's just a sh I won't do undercover without the rubber, so leave me alone. Damn. <laughs> Hold up. Because Luffy with his stretching and such, but rubber, as in, hey, you can, you can, all I can say is that's a double entendre. Get him gone. Uh, bitch, how the tips ain't do shit inside that clip. You better have some sea stone. I told mm. him, no, brother, I can't do undercover without rubber. Just leave me alone. Mm -hmm. Think 
the solar eclipse. I'm gum gum giant, that's just to shadow my soul. I'm getting it back with crushing break bones. I run in the comma, I stay by the code. Something this big cool rama. If you want the drama, I promise we getting them gone. And there been Kuna Matata, we just on that Mata Mata, leaving them gone. It ain't been no Kuna Matata, it's been Mata Mata. We getting them gone. Leaving them down. Just that. Cool rama, if you want the drama, I promise we getting them gone. Ain't never been Kuna Matata, we just on that Mata Mata, leaving them gone. Warrior of liberation, smile on his face, I ain't never do nothing wrong. But they want me gone. Ain't that funny? Ain't loving at all. I'm about that bitch. I ain't never gonna fall. On the sub and the stuck, man, who you gonna call? Got drip like Lee, bitch. This my peak. I'm at the top this of it all. As usual, Queso kills it with his type of style. No, no biggie. Now let's see how Mari gonna come in. If Dix is just gonna do the chorus, it's cool. But if he has another, if he's gonna actually have a verse, you know, he, he has to. It's his song. Oh, sorry. Jesus walking in these white robes. Hmm. Laughing at my eyes, a different type of cycle. Trying to step to me, you better off on a tightrope. Hmm. Uh, give a fuck about a kaido. I hear the voice, I'm like a maestro. Only Gashima and a sky bro. And I'm screaming, fuck your life, ho. The sun setting on a free people. With the straw hats, chilling with my team, Regal. I'm the type to rock a fella like I'm Beanie Seagull. Blind to him, Fuji. Shout out to Rockefeller Records. Shout out to Beanie Seco and such. Hey, Mari just one thing with the one thing I love with Mari and such, lad. He's like he know he gonna rap his shit and give you like bars, and in a way you can say, cause in certain raps, in certain songs that he makes, or when he's featured on songs, you you can guarantee you can see how much of his music like taste he has and such because i've seen him shout out the likes of eminem tupac biggie who else jay-z nas and now freaking bean seagull and such now i'm gonna be honest the only time i've ever heard of bean seagull was when it was in a conversation about greatest rappers and such so don't hate on me if i don't know much of his music and such so if I don't know much of him, music and such, but I have heard his name in the past, so yeah. But with Mari, he gonna definitely give you like his like music inspirations. You can say whenever he does his rapping. So shout out to Mari, shout out to the menace. Uh, give a fuck about a I hear the voice, I'm like a maestro. Only a Gashima and a sky, bro. And I'm screaming, fuck your life, ho. The sun setting on a free people. With the straw hats, chilling with my team, Regal. I'm the type to rock a fella like I'm Beanie Seagull. Blind to him, Fuji Tora, I don't see this the is my peg. I was never known to be big. Number one head and now I roll with oh. a flag. This is my peg. He's gonna have a first. Throw with a sig. Only better when I got control of the peg. This is my peg. I was never known to be big. Number one head and now I roll with a flag. This is my peg. Coming for the throne with a sig. Only one winner got control of the peg. I let it bang, that's what this drum bout Somehow, they let me get litty So it's fun now, from now I'ma be that nigga till the sun's out Sky nigga. zone, I done turned this shit into a jump house mm. I'm in my zone, you should take a look around Godly ass drip, bro, my head up in the clouds hey. Set it brown, brown Godly ass drip, but my head up in the clouds God, that clouds and such And then, this, and the same thing with Diggs is the same thing like with Peso. When you hear his style and such, and how he comes on a song, pause. It's just infectious, where it gives you that bounce type energy. Where the minute you, that's where you know when an artist is good with like riding on the beat. Pause again. <laughs> Look, don't take these out of count things. You know what I mean. So yeah. With this drum bout somehow They let me get litty so it's fun oh, now. now From now, I'ma be that nigga till the sun's out Sky zone, I done turn this shit into a jump house I'm in my zone, you should take a look around Godly ass drip, bro, my head up in the clouds Set it brown, brown, now believe it, I'm the best Run the block, eyes clearing, it's the red ring of death mm. Hold your breath, ain't no speaking, you should step off No, I carry heat, I be seeking with this red heart No, then the mushy when I'm finna let the tech talk Oh, you feeling salty, bro? Bro, I got you. Here's a best. This is my pig. I was never known to be big. Number one head and now I 
roll with a flesh my pay coming for the throne with a sag only one when I got control of the pig. this is my pig I was never known to be wet number one hit and when I roll with the flesh coming for the throne with a sag only one when I got control of the pig. this is my pig hey Shout out to those three, man. They did their thing. Now we got Free Soul and Dave D with a Disney princess rap. One thing I've seen with. And I've seen like a comment on what? Twitter or so? I saw it like on Twitter where I think it was either Free Soul or somebody, right? I think it was Key the Weep, she said. Where she said about how this needs to be a new, in a way you can say, new like genre or so of nerdcore, calling it like what Disney core. Somebody said it. I don't know who. If I don't know if it was either Free Soul or Dave. I'm pretty sure it wasn't Dave D. Pretty sure it was either Free Soul or Key the Weeb who said that. But hey, one thing with Free Soul, he gonna go, cause normally people will find will do like a. Like an anime rap on a certain show or a character that's fire right now. But Dave D. Oh, sorry, not Dave D. But like Free Soul is going to say like, nah, y'all doing this? Cool and all. He going to hop on the train eventually. Pause. Look. Pause on everything that I say that sounds freaky and such. But with him, he's going to do do like a, do a different type of rap or type of song that is out the blue. Because the fact that he's doing a Disney princess rap and such ain't nobody I've, I've known and such in Nerdcore is going going that route. <laughs> so, hey. You're listening to Free Soul. Free Soul. Free Soul. Girl, why you do this to me? Real life love ain't like the movies. Hey. Hey. Why you do this to me? Real life love ain't like the movies. Now I'm just so picky, choosy. Got me fucked up. I just do me. Go see your body, so hands like Milan. Pocahontas, I'm feeling like Sean. Hey. The princess, I'm flicking the wand. All that we went through, I'm breaking the bond. Once upon a time, it's no fable. Long flaws, this shit get tangled. Hey. Next door, give us strength. Girl, our class shape two triangles. Took a piece of bed, I'm looking for my bell. Changing the voice, I'm singing my name like every yell. And I like how he's playing off by every Disney princess out there. The the Tangle chick. I think she's this Mulan. Like bro, Cinderella now and such. Like he's going Like hold on, I gotta go back. Let me see if I can be able to catch all of them if I can't. So here we go. Here we go. Let me see if I can catch all of them. From what Mulan, she just said it. Girl Pocahontas. I'm at their next Jogan Von Strangle, fairy yard parents type shit, okay? The Little Mermaid and the Beast, the Beauty and the Beast one ended. The, arrow, the Little Mermaid one. I got the candy nose and it's snow like polo. I wonder how Dave D for the one thing I know with Dave D, he finna spit crate. He gonna go crazy on this. Cause we know how this man can rap rap and such. So Dave D take it away. Can't choose. Got me fucked up. I just feel me. I saw my bitch that I'm cold like I'm frozen. Hey. Ooh. Scarlet ass and we make an imprint. 
Oh, hold up. I to what I told y'all? I told y'all this nigga gonna snap. Every time me and Freely bitch is over. I can run again. I need a bitch like a prince head. Every time we talk, I shit hit it like a sister. On the smoke, we had to burn like an incense. Your bitch smack on the ass of me. Hey, hey, friend. Why'd you listen to me, Princess Jasmine? How you do me? Hey. It's ain't like the movies. Me and Free, I'll get into it. I just smoked the blood. I rolled them up. They tried to do me. You ain't strong enough. They throwing up. I thought you were doing this. You want nigga dripping the south. You need a south. I'm dripping on the dick. You're frozen just like she else. Hey. 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 H
to me nice. I got on my gibby with a blade in my right. I make all opponents go afraid in my sight. Would have thought I was a villain moving late in the night. And I like the loop flows and such. They can try to keep me in the chance. Why are you gonna say me like that when I'm reacting? Every day, and every day, you always are interrupting. Go. But you want to see how you react? Well, you see now, so go, please. No, you are saying me. Oh, that's not reacting. Mary, just go, please. What so what I can't see? That's interrupt. I'm not interrupting you to them. Yes, you are. Go. Yep. You can't close up. Not Hope you'll enjoy that scary a little jump that I got. So <laughs> Y'all better have liked that jump and such. Go on my gibby with a blade in my right. I make all opponents go afraid in my sight. Would have thought I was a villain moving late in the night. Ain't nobody playing in the game. Feel like Julius would have blended on my determination. That's great. They can try to keep me in the chain like I got. Now, y'all not going to tell me she was right behind me. Watch me running. Beg your pardon. Now, y'all going to tell me she wasn't behind me. That's some else. Y'all not real fans if y'all didn't tell me she was behind me. They really getting me started. Oh, I gotta get it regardless. They see the kid and mark them as a target. Oh. <laughs> Mm. I can do it dirty in the meantime. Nonetheless, no, a brother got a rewind. And just think of the trouble I caused in the past. Nonetheless, no, I don't want to crash. Through a battle with all my opponents, knowing that they motive turned me into ash. Mm. And the festival with the several rest to hold it in my palm and wood it in my grass. Mm. No, I don't need my toe in the tag. I just need to be top of the class. Hey. Hold on, let me. Before I get into the next song, y'all niggas think. Ish, y'all didn't tell me that she was behind me and such. Y'all not my real, y'all not humble squad. Y'all didn't tell me she was behind me and such. Now who am I kidding with the way how I got these headphones in? Why do you think most of the times I be looking like this and such? So that way I don't see that they coming in. I guess it's my fault. But either way, now we got Jeesh squad in them. Special audio. Hey, I know this was two weeks old. Two weeks ago he dropped this. Yeah, two weeks ago. But look, man. It might... I don't care if it's two weeks old and such. The fact that it's still new and such to me and to everybody else. Hey, all I'm saying is, Ty Wild, where you at, nigga? Drop some music. Let's get it. Hey, 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 oh, bitch. Hey, 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 motherfucker. Hey, hey, what? Let's go. Hey, let's go. Hey, look. You ain't gonna take no shit, that's mine, boy, I got a snout <laughs> Sauce him out of this world, I'm out B, how the fuck you route? I'm <laughs> with a squad in them, ganged up in the suburbia, we off the map Say they ain't robbing them, if any opposing folks should leave a whole flat Back the door, we fucking them barricades with wood and it ain't six If little hoe know the big bro flow, the little hoe know the little hoe nicks Fuck with shame, I stand on top of the game, ballin' but I don't flip Still in it out in a t-shirt tuck, they thought it was footloose, ain't the chin Yo, Zoe and always getting shiced, bending over little hoe life Well, talker won't come fight me, cop the grounds and spend on price Hopping out the bitch Bro Shout out to the Florida and such. Shout out to Peso, Mari, Jish and such. And any other nerdcore artists there in Florida and such. Shout out to y'all because in a way you can say Florida has been like my second home and such. Because I've lived there for the past nine years and such. But now that I'm in Connecticut. Because you are, if y'all already know my situation, you're good. But all I'm saying is with Florida... It's so crazy that I kind of know certain slangs there and such. So... Hey, but then again, there are certain slangs that even though I'm Jamaican and all, and like I said, I've been there for nine years, certain s slang and such, I still never know. <laughs> so, yeah. But I like the Florida style, but I've been there. Certain words brought out to the birds like they get offended. Twitter. Twitter and such. Look. All I'm saying is with people. Look. 
and this whole thing with Twitter and whatnot and such, or hey, man, I'm calling it, it's still called Twitter. Figures you talking about, because as soon as when you still go on it, it's still going to be called Twitter. So I don't know why people want to call it X and such. Nigga, it's still called Twitter to me. But regardless, I don't get why most, there's the fact that most people want to get offended by certain work, certain things and in such, then either two of things, either one, you're too sensitive, or two, you some it's not even most of the times when it's it don't be even a it don't even be work it don't even be addressed to you right so how are you gonna be offended if nine times out of ten if it's not concerning you or if it's not part of a community that you're in and such why are you offended right now granted right there are certain things that people shouldn't like try to say or do and such because nine times out of ten, uh-uh. We're not in old times and such where if you would have done it there or said it back then, you would have got away with it. Today, no way. But if majority of the times is not even that serious, then then at this point, or if it contains to something like the essay, the R word, you know, like a gra grape, emphasis on grape, <laughs> but take the G out and you know what that is. If it's, if it's concerned with that, the, the grape, the race, the, the racism, racism, and other things like that particular thing, then nah, we ain't, then nah, you gonna get up, we gonna make sure you get up out of here. But if it's nothing like that, right? And if it's not that too serious and such, why is it concerning you? Like, shut the fuck up and move on with your life. That's all I'm saying. Hmm. Wait, what you say? Oh, I gotta say with Jeesh, Jeesh, it's so crazy that with a picture like Jeesh, like if y'all see it right here, right? He probably gonna push it up at the end, but right? If you see a picture like Jeesh and you hear how he's rapping, Ain't no way this fits him, and ain't no way you can tell me he's from Florida. <laughs> I'm straight up with you, but like that old saying goes, don't judge a book by its cover, because who knows? Jeesh may be that, that bow tie wearing bandit that might ep around and start murking one of y'all niggas. <laughs> Just say paragraph will get him out no more search. Flag and folk will catch the boot if he was flagging first. Mm. Get from God, but I got a curse to the bag is whatever words. Mm. Ain't gonna take no shit, that's mine, boy. I got a snout. Saw some out of this world. All my be how the fuck you route. I'm mm. in the squad and them. Gang up in the suburbia, we off the mouth. Same ain't robbing them. If any opposing folks should leave a whole flat. Back in the door, we fucking them barricades with wood and it ain't sick. If little hoe know the big bro flow, the little hoe know the little hoe nits. Hold the shame, I stand at the top of the game, ballin', but I don't flip. Stepping it out in a t shirt tuck, they thought it was foot loose getting the chin. <laughs> they thought it was foot loose. Yeah, well, that's where you were, nigga. Hey, like, look, look at this nigga. You would never think that this nigga is can rap like that. But hey, just like look at this nigga. Look at this nigga. You would never think a nigga like him that looks like this and such. Can rap rap and such, but look the whole thing like like I was saying earlier with Mari's like inspiration with the likes of like Eminem and such. Look, still to this day, right? And people are still questioning or some either 
critics or artists they sell for whatnot black artists in general hating ones in general are still questioning why are still like saying that eminem is not one of the best rappers and trust me you would see who they are y'all seen my channel y'all seen when i reacted to easy meal and eminem's realest song where basically eminem was going after the likes of like the game melly mel or basically not even the realest one just look at every other interview that involves somebody who's hating on eminem because because the, the reason why he's one of the top greatest rappers and such is because of his skin color not not even because of his skill and such they're not even talking about the skill and such but because one of white because of his skin color being white and two because that most of the times the hood doesn't listen the hood doesn't listen to eminem nigga so freaking what at the end of the day nigga if you want to become a rapper and you're really serious about one of listening to bars listening to how you can bend words the lyrics the lyricism the talent and such hey at the end of the day eminem if you're gonna want to listen to stuff like that i'm not saying you can't listen to other ones who do it and such but nine times out of ten for who i know probably might listen to eminem is gonna be their go-to guy and hey people say they don't bump around eminem as much nigga i know i would here fuck is you talking about let me get into a let me get my own car right and if anyhow when i get a job in search and i go to work you best believe i'm bumping eminem songs no matter if it's old or new i'm bumping the eminem song but shit sure yeah a black nigga like me black jamaican nigga like me is gonna bump some eminem for shit sure so i don't want nobody so they should never but still to this day like i say people are still gonna hate on eminem but that's the same thing like I could say with Jish too. Because at the end of the day, y'all may look at him and think like, oh, he can't rap and such. But at the end of the day, if he's spitting shit like this and the way how he sounds, hey, it could go for a viral moment for that guy. So shout out to Jish and such. But next now, we got another song and such. Hold on. Sorry if I'm rambling so much. So get ready for iconic live performances by Anita. Demi Don't care. We got an but shout out speaking of Mari again, we got another Mari song, Mari feature and such, but which this time with KB and Crollo, a law rap lawless. And shout out to shout out to Crollo because I'm pretty if I'm not mistaken, I saw on Twitter that he got enlisted into the army. So hey, shout out to you, my guy. Nah, nah. Like, cause nine times out of ten, when I hear Mari is like singing and such, why well, I feel like that's not him and but the other person? Cause when we, when I can know it's Mari rapping and such, oh, I'm gonna know that's Mari. But whenever he does do like the singing part and such, it's hard to tell, right? Cause I'm not gonna lie to you. Nine times out of ten, I know Mari just for the instant from when he starts to rap and such. Not from when he like, cause he rarely ever does that, rarely does the singing and such show. show. So, unless it's a specific artist that I know sing, I know singing wise, I can tell from, like if it was Maguire and Mari, I can tell who, I can definitely tell the difference between who is singing and such. Yeah. 
Yeah, I think this is Mari. What the Then they move. Over there. Hey, my face like Nelly. Damn. <laughs> so yeah, that's that's definitely Mari with a bar like that. <laughs> see what I mean? This nigga would. You see what I mean? This nigga would literally give out a hip hop reference right there. On Diggs, he shouted out Be Beanie Seagull, and now on this one, shouted out Nelly and such. Tupac now, you see what I mean? So in these last three, in these last two songs, he shouted out Beans, Beanie Seagull, Nelly, and now Tupac with the Machiavelli and such. Come on now. You cannot tell me this nigga is not loving hip doesn't know his hip hop. No boy like Monkey Valley. If you don't have my product, then don't call up my celly. I know I heard I have problems, but my shit's still selling steady. Keep my issues underground if they come up, then we got thirty. I'm gonna weed them niggas out from all that extra fat I'm heavy. Set niggas just got me another check. Nigga, come try to melt down on my club and give a nigga think of two. Just so put down for my funds. This is not a stick of two. I'm never tricking. I like them. Use my pistol. I like the vibe of this one. It's too hard to keep the peace, so I keep my peace to ease. Mm. Any situation where my peace can make the peace. Wow. I can't feel my heart again, I'm gonna sit on the seas. I can't feel my heart again, I'm gonna sit on the seas. I'm gonna come up hard again, I'm probably feeling loose. I can't feel my heart again, I'm gonna be in the pain. Like the chop in school and such, okay. Hey, shout out to Crollo and Mari and again, Mari again on another song. And like I said, if, if no, you are probably, yeah, you are on your duty. So, yeah, shout out to you, my boy, on your duty of being in the army, man. Keep, keep doing what you're doing there, man, bro. But now, we on to our last song that after this stupid ad. Here at Office Depot Office. Stupid ads. Hey. Ah. Max. I can't today. wait to and get you to a premium. On our best -selling school. But now, it's the last song. Yeah, last song of Music Mayhem, Nikki Tracks, Stain Rap, Stain, with featuring Vinny New and Crazy Q. And little known fact, to me, I don't know about y'all, but to me, I didn't even know Vinny New was part, was the, was one part of Rocket Music. Straight up with you. Did not even know that. So, hey, that's what I be saying with the Nerdcore. It be surprising me almost every single time. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I didn't even know there was two people in Rocket Music. Straight up. So hey, regardless, let's get into it. Make sure that our quality is here. Stain was a vicious person in my hero. Legends of the world better dig their grave. Every hero dead, time to learn my name mm. Another drop of blood, lick it off my blade mm. In the ashes of the earth, gonna leave I know what you're thinking, you're thinking I'm crazy But what if I'm jaded, I feel like I'm wasting away And afraid if I wait any longer, I might just forget where I came from I might just forget all the progress I made off my trauma I took what I went through and made it a profit They hang on my words like a comma That grammar helped raise me, but that was my nana So mm. what if they yeah, grammar come. Kind of, what they say, cause I am a pro So that I make it and I am not stopping I knew it was faded, cause I am a prophet No, you hate it, cause I made it, I'm the greatest, you gon' see Just admit it, you get anxious, I can feel it when you speak Applying the pressure, I know that you feel it But trying to get him and I'm gonna forget it I'm out of my mind, I'm losing my time I wanna know something Why is it that it's always whenever a rap 
like a nerdcore artist does like a villain rap they just become way more vicious like i've seen it with we've seen it with dps we've seen it with daddy fat snaps that whenever he does like a villain rap he be going freaking disgusting on it because not to hate on when they doing like the protagonists and such not to hate on it right we know that's we know it's still fire it can be still fire but something about when not just dps but any nerdcore artist that whenever they do like a villain rap you see they go buck nasty and the aggression and such just comes out more fire than ever so what if they hate me? Spitting and shit. Fuck what they saying, cause I am a problem. So that I make it and I am not stopping. I knew it was faded, cause I am a prophet. No, you hate it, cause I made it. I'm the greatest, you gon' see. Just admit it, you get anxious, I can feel it. When you speak, I'm applying the pressure, I know that you feel it. But I ain't to get him, and I won't forget it. I'm out of my mind, I'm losing my temper, been all on my crime. I remember when I said that you get out of line, you gotta regret it. Fuck my mind, it's best that you get it. Playing with fire, not really the guy. You telling them lies, I know what you're saying. <laughs> Legends of the world better dig there. I'm guessing that's that's Vini. Every hero dead, time to learn my name. Another drop of blood, lick it off my blade. In the ashes of the earth, gonna leave my stain. Ooh, that's Vini. My blade. Okay, crazy Q. Okay, my nigga, hold up. Run that butt. Run that back. You running out. You run out of time. Hands to the face. You about to get clocked. Running out of time. The hands, cause they say that these two are the hands and such. And clock. Come on. A whole clock Never mind, stop. I'm jaded and bitter. Can't get a little. Nobody noticed that I should be on top. I'm full of the venom, the rules. I'm a venom, the goons. I'm a set them. They do what I tell them. Hakuna Matata. Today I'm a dead. I'm a doula. I've been God and stain. Said about them. I don't mean to be. What the fuck, nigga? I would love crew. I told them a time and a two and a five. Like, what the hell, nigga? Who tell you to get this saucy Q? What the hell? I'm full of the venom, the rules. I'm a venom. Hold on. I want to make sure this is like. The order that I'm saying. Yeah, I'm right. Hold up, Q. Nah, go back. Get it this time. Nah, I can't crack. face <laughs> Never mind, stop. I'm jaded and bitter to pick it a little. Nobody noticed that I should be on top. I'm full of the venom, the rules. I'm a venom, the goons. I'm a set them. They do what I tell them. Hakuna Matata today. I'm a dead. I'm a doula. I've been God and stay set them. I don't mean to be mean. I mean, I've seen the things that I've seen from teams that never bleed like me. It seems that it's staying deep down in my jeans like that. I'm <laughs> I don't want to tell you what I'm about to do. Fuck that shit, I don't sing, I rap. <laughs> Nigga. I was about to say, what the hell? You about to sing? He said, fuck that. Fuck that, I don't sing, I rap. <laughs> you oh, nah, that was fire. <laughs> what about to do? Fuck that shit, I don't sing, I rap. <laughs> Right after crazy, crazy Q, nigga. Every crazy, what the hell, my nigga? Why you have to go crazy like that? Off my blade. I'm gonna leave my stay. Man. And Vinny came with that energy for this song, uh, with that book. My stain, gonna leave my stain, gonna leave my stain, gonna leave my stain, gonna leave my stain. Hey man, y'all niggas went wow. And of course, you already know, like I said, with Nikki, this, look, it's basically like this. At this point, I feel like all nerdcore artists that whenever they doing like a villain rap and such, sorry, got my headphones down. 
whenever y'all doing like a villain rap, I want to make uh, y'all better go freaking crazy. Like, actually crazy on these, because, nigga, something about when a, when the nerdcore, when a nerdcore artist does like a villain rap, it just makes it ten times more better. I don't know why it just does. But hey, either way, shout out to everybody on this music mayhem and such. Let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. Which song was fire and such. And shout out to everybody on this and such. Freaking sneaky freaking. Hold on. Let me look at the list and such. From like Nikki, Free Soul, Chris, Jeesh. Everybody on this and such. Because nigga, y'all didn't have to go that crazy. But y'all did. But either way, like I said. It's been your boy Humble Singy signing out. Make sure to go check out my other reactions right here. Follow me on all my socials up there. And if you want to do a Cash App donation request, hit me up on my Cash App and let me know what you want me to react to. But it's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Roll to 2K, like I said. There you go.